up, y'all? And we're gonna go back to another video. Okay, so updates. Um, it's hot. It doesn't feel like winter. Um, it's actually Thursday, and your girl. Where's my glasses? Oh, my glasses are filthy. Uh, have you been looking at me like this all day? That's disgusting. Um, anyways, it's Thursday, and I haven't vlogged since Sunday, and that weekend vlog the y'all so, so that's a thing. But I was okay, so listen, so boom. I was gonna start vlogging yesterday. I knew I wasn't vlogging Monday. Um, Tuesday was just too boring. So I was like, I'm gonna start vlogging too yesterday or whatever. Because I did stop by a couple of places and you know, did what I had to do. But yesterday was just not a good day, bro. Like yesterday was just not a good day, like at all. Like I couldn't even function yesterday, like Everything was pissing me off, and I, I just, yesterday was just not a good day for me. Um, it's because of my period, so I know why it wasn't a good day. But, crybaby Alicia, <laughs> I boohoo cried for like five minutes, and then I was good again. So, <laughs> I woke up, and today was just the best day. Like, today was just such a good day day um I, a little stuff like got on my nerves because i'm just irritated easily anyways um uh, well what's nothing too crazy like let me tell you what just just happened so this girl this lady is like trying to get over and it's like two cars can fit between my car and the car that was in front of me and she still was scared to get over i was like see that's why everybody don't need a license okay so that just happened and that just irritated me and made me want to go home and go lay in the bed and cry. But now, I'm okay. I'm good. My car has the new car smell all over again. It comes and goes every so often, so I know what's up with that. But um, yeah, uh, as far as other things goes, I'm reading the best book. I'm officially out of this little book. I wasn't in a book slump. I just was not enjoying reading as much like i read some good books don't get me wrong i have been reading some good books the last couple books i read have been good books but i just haven't been like on the edge wanting to watch it over 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 like read it and not stop but the book i started yesterday y'all i didn't even want to stop reading it so i'm happy about that because i really love reading and i really love when i can enjoy books like that and it's because of lately i just been taking so many breaks in between books i've literally only read 13 books this year y'all and y'all know at the end of last year I was reading 20 to 25 books every single month. So yeah, this is a little different. Um, what else? Um, my Shein package still isn't here. Um, I don't know what's going on with my Shein package. It's been saying it was on the flight from China since the fourth, and it's the tenth. By the way, today's my mother's birthday, so that's the thing. But it's the tenth. And my package is still saying China flight. No flight is lasting six days at all. So I don't know what's up with that and where that package is. USPS is saying they haven't guided it. Like, I don't know what's the update on that. I don't know why it's not updating or moving or whatever it's supposed to be doing. So that's that. And then Amazon, I just placed a big book order today so i'm not gonna get that to next wednesday or so so that's kind of disappointing because that, that might not be in this vlog hopefully it is but it might not be in this vlog but um i had to return the shirt again so i did get in a bigger size and it fit the exact same like it wasn't even like it went up a size so they probably made one size fit all and just say it's a different size when in reality it's really just a large so yeah, that's the thing. Um, if I return it, I'm waiting on my refund though, and they they tripped on my refund this time. Yeah, no, Amazon refund is hitting in like three seconds, but this time it didn't. So I don't know what's up with that. My glasses are irritating me, but I'm finna go home. I'm not finna go nowhere. Also, I've been eating clean and working out every single day, and I've been um weighing in every single morning. I'm not gonna say any results. Yeah, I'm doing this for ten days straight. 
I don't know about going to the gym 10 days straight, but I will be, you know, weighing in every morning and trying to eat as clean as possible because it is Super Bowl Sunday on Sunday. Buffalo chicken little wings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, mm, but yeah, but let me start rambling and talking and I will talk to y'all later on when I do something else. I have an update for y'all. In and up door dash and some food. Ooh. Okay, y'all, it's 9.21 and I, ooh, it's kind of hit. Uh, but I am about to head to the gym. Um, I'm only doing the treadmill. I don't, I'm going to do it for 30 minutes if I don't hit two miles before then. So, I'm, I'm, my goal is to do two miles. And if I hit 30 minutes and not hit two miles, then I'm going to go ahead and keep going until i hit two miles depending on how tired i am um but my goal is two miles today and that's it y'all my body is through like <laughs> my body need a rest day so bad um so it's coming but we got things to do we got goals to reach so i'm gonna go put in some type of work okay some type of work so, so let's go okay y'all i'm off work and somehow i'm at the mall i'm not here to like spend like crazy money or nothing but I need like a black shirt, like, and I kind of want a tube, like a cute little tube shirt, if I can get that. But I want a cute little black shirt to wear tomorrow. So that's that's the plan. That's the goal to get cute little black shirts. So I'm at the mall. I'm gonna go to Rainbows, and then. I'm finding rainbows. I'm going to Ross, maybe. I don't know. I don't know if I feel like dealing with Ross. And then I'm going to Old Navy. So we gonna see how this finna work out. Y'all, this is why I can't come to the mall. Because why? I secured the bag, by the way. I secured the goods. But why am I up here in belt in the men's section? Because I had to walk past, you know, to get to the goods. And I see these really cute graphic tees. That would go great with the vibes. Like, and now I want one, so I'm gonna get it. Well, I'm trying to see if my mom want one before I just buy it. Cause she want one, I get one too. You know, birthday and all that good stuff. Definitely want this. Definitely. Definitely about to get this one. Like I need anything that's orange in it. But we move. I'm gonna move on to a new color. But we move. Um, yeah, definitely get this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, y'all. So I just got back home, and I want to show y'all the things that I bought. Low key on accident, but first thing is this graphic tee from Belk. I didn't even know Belk had graphic tees like this, y'all. This is so cute, and it go perfect with my old Crocs. Y'all see it? Y'all see the vision? Um. Loki can wear this as a dress because it is so freaking long. So let me show y'all. So yeah, this is a look as a t-shirt dress. So I might. Mm -hmm. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, this is the shirt I got. From built and it was $26. And I also got my mama one. Hers was on $12, though, but she got Mario one and it's so cute. So if you want graphic tees, tired of the ones at Target because Target has recycled the same ones for two years now. Then we just move in. Um, don't want to go to Route 21, don't have a Route 21. Your next bet is built. So, so y'all, next I got this little crop top long sleeve from 
rainbows and this is literally what i've been ordering from um what is it called from amazon this is literally the shirt i've been ordering from amazon but it's at rainbow and it fits perfectly and i can even tie it up more on the sides like that or i can loosen it up make it short make it longer so yeah this is this shirt at rainbows i didn't have to go to ross i didn't have to go to Rule 21 i mean i didn't have to go to ross and i didn't have to go to old navy because rainbows had it y'all don't sleep on rainbows okay do not sleep on rainbows this is literally what i wanted in the loop tomorrow she gonna hit okay she gonna hit i got off pinterest she gonna hit okay period okay last but not least y'all i have this dress from it's a boutique y'all that's literally been on my feed for the past year and i was like let me just see their website see what they have see you know how they set up so i did and <sighs> this is hard to get into y'all and i ain't know what body con was before getting this dress i know what it is now i actually had to take it to my granddaddy house and get his wife to um fix the strap because the first time i put it on y'all i broke the strap but this is how it looks it makes my girls look so good let me just fix them make sure everything is nice and secure inside the feet so yeah this is the dress y'all and uh, oh my god it's so cute like it's just so cute and you can make this so elegant like i know all my girlies are out y'all and this is not a you know winter dress this is very you know given summer little black dress but i've i don't have a little black dress i have some black dresses but they don't give me little black dress like this one gives me little black dress sleek cute throw some gold jewelry like some gold heels you guys have the perfect wig okay and throw this on yeah i'm gonna show you how short it is though because it she's short but she was also ten dollars this is where she stops she is short this is my booty cheek so if you want a perspective this is the booty cheek so she's short she is but she makes me look so good like i had to put on my underwear space with this and suck this out in and that's the look but she makes for a good thing okay period is it really a weekly body that I have? A she in home? It's really. Mm. <laughs> Let's get it to it. Okay, first thing first, we have this white button now, and it is crispy. And it fits so well, y'all. Like, this is a crispy shirt. Um, I had an outfit, outfit idea for it, but now we're going to take family pictures. Um, so I'm just gonna wear it for our family pictures because we're wearing white button downs and I can't get this button up. We're wearing white button downs and blue jeans, and of course, I know I'm putting on my Air Force Ones because that's the vibe I'm on. I can't do this, but it's just the shirt, it comes down really nice. Um, push out that back just a little bit. So, this is shirt. It's really cute. So the way they wore it um, on Fashion Nova, I mean on Shein, was like off the shoulder. So I'm gonna try to get that, get that vibe. So the next thing I get got was this triangle bomb shirt. Um, it's not very supportive, but it's cute for shirts like this. Obviously, it's giving swim top. So <laughs> off the shoulder vibe. Of course, they didn't wear a bra, but. I'm not wearing it off the shoulder in the pictures, obviously. But if I was, this is how I would wear it. Um, so yeah, really cute, really classy, and it's just really nice. Um, cannot remember the price of it. Um, so that's the thing. But of course, y'all, 
it wasn't that much. I think I spent $88 on shoes. I support it, but it's cute if you want to wear like something that you need nipple covering. Like it gives a vibe for certain shirts. So it's a vibe for this shirt that like, I will wear with this because I don't need the lift up in this shirt, if you know what I mean. Like this is perfect. So yeah, and I got this. And I also got it in pink and white. So and it came in three pack and again wasn't that expensive i got these in a 3x i think no i got these in 4x probably should have got in 3x and this shirt is also a 4x so the next thing i got was this flannel y'all and i am in love so i have a black black bar under it but i scoot it over and i probably wear i could wear this one or the white one, I probably wear the white one to make the white pop more. And yeah, it's just, it's a moment. Like, this is a full length, y'all. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. I have been in love with flannels these past fall, winter. This is my fourth flannel, I think. So be expecting to see me in a lot of flannels coming up. Cause so many different colors. And I, used, I was obsessed with flannels when I was younger, but I never found one in my size. So, now that I have them, Shein came up. I got two from Shein, two from Walmart. Like, I'm, no, I got two from Shein, one from Walmart, and one from Ross. So, yeah, I be in this flannels, okay? But this one is so cute. It's giving girly. I don't know what shoes I wear with these. Probably my Air Force Ones. Y'all know I love my Air Force Ones, okay? But if I had some boots some black chunky boots that's what i wear with them which i plan on getting some black chunky boots maybe i get some before i wear this and get that vibe this would be cute for our tennessee trip when i think about it so yeah it's giving off the shoulder and the only reason it's off the shoulder because i have a bit up but if i want to do it regular this is how i be and i can wear like this open with the white and it'll be such a vibe i probably have to wear some blue tape to lift my boots a little bit but it is such a vibe now, I put the prices here because right now I don't know prices of anything. So, yeah. And while I'm here, I'm going to show you the jewelry that I got in the purse that I got. So, first thing first, I got some bracelets and I got some necklaces. Like I said, is it a shin haul if I don't get jewelry or a purse or underwear? I literally get jewelry every time i shop on shein because i'm trying to build my jewelry collection y'all i'm trying to accessorize so oh these are earrings jk why did i think they was bracelets these are earrings so i have these gold hoops which are so cute i might be pretty pretty today then i have these like rose gold ones same vibe i love the length of these like yes please give me that then i have silver because you need silver and gold in your jewelry collection so yeah that's the earrings and then i have these gold necklaces i need to buy more silver necklaces but gold is my thing i love gold so we have these and i think all these jewelry is like two three dollars a pack for three for three so but i got these set of Aquarius necklaces and it's still Aquarius season so yeah so you have this Aquarius one we have the what's the name the star the uh constellation and then we have the sun so yeah so so cute y'all see today's January 20th February the 20th February the 18th so okay so Bye. next y'all I have this black mostly like turtleneck crop top she is so cute oh my gosh it comes all the way down in the back i love that for me and it's cropped up in front because it has this ruchi like it's like okay let me show you it's like this in the front so that's why it comes up like that but uh, and i know i did all the searching for a black crop top but I knew this was coming in the mail, but I have a different outfit I did for this one. So you can never do wrong with too many black shirts. My business. Anyway, so yeah, this one. Oh, 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 oh my 
longer. I love the way this makes me look like with the black tights. Oh my gosh. This is a look. Oh, I'm in love with her. And let me show you the purse that I got. So I got this little box purse like this. I got no gold detailing, that's my thing. So I can wear it like this. Or I can do this. And she just adds a little something. She just adds a little something. So it's giving Gucci. But like not Gucci, obviously. I just have these gold detailing, the pearl candy gold chain. So yeah, I love her. She's brown. Ah, such a vibe. She is a moment. She is the moment. Okay? The moment. Okay. And y'all know it's not a she and her. If I don't have some type of dress, romper, jumpsuit situation. So she, here she is. It's black. Seems like I got a lot of black. Oh, well. It's black. It has these fur ends. Oh. It is so cute. And then, boom. Okay, she, she's the moment. She, she's the moment. I mean, was it for the link? I would go down a size because it's a little big. But since it's a little short, I'm glad I got this size. But it is big, so if you don't mind the shortness of it, you wear some like pants with it, go down the sides. Because this is my butt cheek. And it works out. So she's short, but she is a moment. Look at the details. They have these two buttons right here. Um, this is just how it looks. Of course, I'm gonna have it closed because this will have a little to look real classy. With some gold jewelry. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She is the moment. Like I said, it is short. It is open. So <clears throat> be mindful. But you can walk in it. You can world. You know? She she's the moment. Okay, what's up, y'all? I am just checking in. I am out and about. I do have the fits on. The necklaces I just got from Shein. Earrings I just got from Shein. Um, the shirt is from Rainbows. I have my Boohoo tights. This blue jean jacket I got from Forever 21, like four years ago. Then I I'm braiding my hair. The hair is hair, and the natural is naturally. And um, I have my Jordan ones. Can't see them. I have my Jordan ones, turf oranges. Um, now I'm gonna go find somewhere to take a pictures. Take some pictures. I just got my eyebrows waxed. Ooh, eyebrows waxed, and then I got uh my underarms waxed, and I feel so free, so alive. So, oh yeah. By the way, it's really hot outside, and this shirt is long. So y'all saw it. I got it from Rainbows. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go to Barnes and Noble and then do the pictures from there. So, yeah, let's drive around to Barnes and Noble and then I'll go from there though when it comes to pictures. So we have the fit. We have this blue jean jacket, like I told y'all, the jewelry, the shades, also for seeing. One day, this big tote bag will be a tail farm. But until we get our tail farm. Y'all, I just lost my glasses. And I don't know how. Like, I don't eat. I don't. There's nothing in me understanding how I just lost these glasses. Like, I took them off and put them in my bag and put my shades on. And then I put my keys in my bag. And my glasses are missing. 
I'm gonna go look one more time, but I'm so they was under my car. <laughs> okay, y'all, so I'm home and I just ate like half of my most burrito. Got to y'all's one of most. Yeah. I ate only half, so this is the other half. I'm not gonna eat it or whatever. Let my food digest for once. I'm not gonna overeat, you know, progress. Okay, we working hard at this not really dieting, but like. A change of habits is what I'm gonna call it because that's what I'm doing. I'm changing my habits. I'm taking off my bra and stuff, y'all. I'll be having to get comfortable once I get in the house because I'm gonna read. I'm not gonna read this, but I did go to Barnes and Noble and get a book. It's called Getting His Game Back, and it's an interracial relationship book. And it looks like it's like cuddly, but like I read the back and it says really like emotional and like this with like depression and interracial relationships and like all that stuff. So I was intrigued. I was gonna get this other book, but it's the first book in a series and I wanna buy the whole series at one time. So I'm just gonna do that another day. Like buy the whole series. Um so I just got a standalone this this is not in my what's the name already. So this is a new book that I've never seen before. So yeah, I'm intrigued and ready to read it. So we gonna see. Also, I did take pictures. I'm gonna put them here, 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 here. I don't know how many good ones I got, but my favorites. I'm gonna put them here and let y'all enjoy those because I just I have a feeling they hit. Okay, I have I just have this strong feeling that they went crazy. So I'm gonna go through them now before I really get to reading. I gotta sit up for a while to let my food like digest again. I've been doing this for a while now, sitting up after, my, after I eat. But yeah, sitting up, let my food digest. I'm gonna finish a whole bottle of water. I don't guess she, like practice good habits. So I just ate heavy. And yeah, continue on with my day. So y'all already got my hair tied up, but I'm actually gonna do an at home workout. Um, let me take these necklaces off. I'm gonna do an at home workout from YouTube. I actually seen it earlier. It's like 35 minutes, which is perfect. Um, yeah, and it says it's called. I got a lot of workouts in this little workout thing that I need to start by doing. But, uh, it's by Body for Days by Jerrica. It's called Walk the Weight Off. So, yeah, I'm gonna do this workout. Sweat a little bit. Ooh, get, it, get it on and popping. And I might get a little couple of clips for y'all. We'll see. <laughs> I just got back home from brunch with my mommy and my sister. Y'all seen our food. Um, I think I'm gonna love my hair more today than I was yesterday. Like, it's so cute. <laughs> Anyways, just got home. I just got this tie switch on. Y'all know this is my favorite. Um, I'm just gonna update y'all real quick. So I finished this book right here, y'all. She was good. She was good. She was really good. Um, I love CM Stench, and I just realized that I'm just gonna read her whole bad list. Not her fantasy books, but all her romance, romance, standalone series, all that. She got some really, really, really long series. So I'm in love with her. I read one of her series last year, and that's what made me pick her up again anyway. So I'm like officially in love with her. So yeah, but now I'm gonna read um this cozy mystery because i haven't read the cozy mystery in a minute this is the second book in the series it is the cider shop mystery series second book um really loved the first one like i said so finna read this really excited to get into that today is super bowl sunday and i'm gonna go to my granddad's house today but we are cooking here and then taking over there so i'm making buffalo chicken dip i'm making a dump dip and then making meatballs my mom making wings and sandwiches then my auntie is making sandwiches and rotels. So we're gonna have a feast. I wanted to get some rattlesnake buckets from um Chris's Royal House, but I'm not gonna do it because we're already gonna have a lot of food. So and I cannot afford to overeat today. I already had very, very filling brunch. I had a grilled chicken club though, grilled, okay. But the fries, baby, the fries. And I had a call, so yeah. Gotta be careful on what I eat this evening because i do not have that many calories to spare so i'm gonna keep it real light because i cannot like i said i cannot afford to overeat but i'm just gonna watch the ghost whisperer read this book 
and um yeah chill for the next two three hours and then start cooking and get ready to go home in the house I'm trying to be over there by 5 5 15 and time to make it to his house before like the game if like pre-game stuff starts all that so okay y'all my hair look crazy but i'm just gonna go my granddaddy house so it's fine but um okay i'm finally finna head to my granddaddy house it's 5 20 the game started in 10 minutes so i need to hurry up but i have the goods back there i just got two dips and sandwiches my mom got the chicken and the meatballs but she ain't done frying the chicken yet so she's gonna be a minute <laughs> But it's already food over there too. So yeah. Finna head there. I gotta go. Cause I'm gonna go. What's up, y'all? Oh my gosh. When was the last time I vlogged? Yesterday, but like when yesterday. You feel me? Like when did I vlog last yesterday? I don't know. But hey, what's up? Y'all doing? It is Monday and I am in a wonderful mood, even though I had a little blimp because people don't know how to drive. But now I'm in a good mood. Everybody gonna give me a tea because my mama got me $25 and two chocolate, two big chocolate heart thingies for Valentine's Day. So, look at it. Ah! Ah! I'm gonna go get a tea. This is gonna be my tea card for this couple days. The teas are $8. And I'm gonna get Valentine's tea today. I am gonna get Valentine's tea today. But teas are $8. Well, the Valentine's tea could be $9. But $25, I can get like two and a half. So, yeah, I'm just so excited. Do I gotta gotta? Why I look like this? Is this card okay? Mm, is she okay? Your pen is the last four digit of your card number five. Yeah, it looks. Y'all can't, can y'all use this? I don't think so. But, do y'all see that? How it's like, blurry? Is it? Hey y'all, how y'all doing? Ooh, why it looks like I'm so, I don't like that. <laughs> Anyways, got me a tea. I got the Call Me Maybe. It's a Valentine's Day special. Use my gift card as I should. And actually, I have... I can buy two more teas with this gift card because they're eight dollars. This one's nine dollars, so of course now the rest of them are eight dollars. So I can get two more. Am I gonna remember my card right there? I'm gonna get this one. So I'm so excited. This is Larry my tea card. I'm gonna get a tea every day. Um, but yeah, I got the call me maybe. Really needed this booze because y'all. I cut up this weekend eating wise and I'm, I'm really gonna go home and eat my leftovers and I haven't been working out like I should be like, I worked out Saturday but y'all I didn't sweat as much as I needed to compared to like how I usually sweat when I do my workout so I really need to work out tonight am I I don't know because apparently I got a date y'all apparently I got a valentine I don't know I don't know child mmm I just like strawberry lemonade Mm. Oh, it literally tastes like strawberry lemonade. I love that for me. I keep going out of focus. I don't know why it's doing this. But yeah, y'all, apparently I got a date tonight. So, will the gym happen? I don't know, but it's. He said he may have a reservation for seven, so. If that's the case, I'm gonna try to leave by 8 30. <laughs> so I go to the gym. Oh my god, it's terrible, but I don't know. We'll see what happened though. I'll update y'all, of course. So I don't know if I said in the last clip, but that tea schmeck. Anyways, I got oh, uh, this is not my package. Come on, mama. I think I know what this is. Five package, right? Yeah, so let's open my package. I ain't struggling today. I'm gonna use a knife. Ah, I'm so excited. Y'all, three of these books was like $6. 
I mean, y'all thought I was gonna buy five books at a time when three of them were six dollars. Like, come on. so I got this one, Birthday Girl, which this one's like sixteen dollars, but it's a Banana Beef Douglas book. I and adore her book so much. This is a forbidden romance book with a older man. Like, it's her boyfriend's dad and her. <laughs> so excited to read this. Oh my gosh. I've heard good things about this. It's 400 pages. So not bad at all. These next two novellas, y'all. I'm going to finish these in like the same day. But it's two Rizzi Allen books. It's... What is it called? Okay. Surrender and Eight by Rizzi Adams, y'all. I had to get these because I've been wanting to read. I, if y'all don't know, I'm going to read Rizzi Adams' whole backlist this year. So, I'm, I'm, I'm really almost done with her. But look how little her books are. So, like, this one, like, is 60 pages. And this one's probably less than it. <laughs> this is 40 pages. So really short, her novellas are so freaking short. That's why they were six dollars. But I love, I love her writing. Like it gets the job done. Okay. So that's just. Then I have these song woods. Um, this is a book club pick for the book troop. I read a book from the book troop last month. That's the first book book club that I read a book from. The book I just read, Razor Blood Tears, Razor Blade Tears, for the second book club that I'm in. And that was their favorite pick. So this is. The book trip February pick, and I'm so excited to read it. Zee Solid Woods. I don't know much about it. I'm really going in it blind. But I did read it a little bit, and I know I was interested enough to pick it up. So I did. But I'm pretty sure I'm just going to pick up every book for both book clubs. Because I'm just interested to be a part of the conversation. So there's that. And then the last book I got, this book I was so surprised. I think it was on sale, though. But it was like $6.95. And it's The Devil Wears Black by L.J. Sheen. Um... I hear nothing but good things about them. So. I just got home, but I wanted to show y'all that I did my makeup. I didn't go anywhere but the gym, but I did my makeup. So, boom, makeup, eyebrows, y'all know. I'm going to snatch the brows. And, yeah, I just left the gym, though, and I'm really sweaty. Um, So, I need to go wash this makeup off and take a real hot, steamy shower. I should be taking a shower. I should be taking a cold one. But I really, really, really need a hot shower right now. So, I'm just going to take a hot shower and deal with the consequences tomorrow. Um, But I had to jump on the vlog because I haven't talked to y'all since I got off work. Well, since, yeah, since I got out of work and show y'all my book mail. I have not updated y'all. So, yes. this uh, The date didn't happen, but I knew that. I told y'all that, like... I'm not stupid. Like, I know how people work. Like, people are lame. That's why I don't like people. <laughs> everybody's lame to me. Literally, everybody's lame to me. So, I just don't deal with people. This is why I stay to myself, like, on this self-care journey. That's why I care for myself so much. Because if I ain't got me, if I ain't got myself together, my mind together, my thoughts together, like, my emotions together... I would break down every single day because how much I hate people. Like, so I'm so glad I'm not that person no more because me, a year and a half ago, I'd be sitting in the house crying right now, eating up a bunch of snacks. But I didn't do that. I was like, let me take this energy and go to the gym and burn it off. Like, I didn't binge eat nothing, like, none of that. Like, no, like. Went to the gym. I still got cute because for myself, this gym that I have on is cute. It's for myself. Like, I do this for myself regardless of what happens, what goes on. I'm going to do this for myself. That's why I constantly take myself out on dates and stuff. Like, because I don't need nobody, y'all. My standards are high. Like, and if I ain't getting what I'm, like, what I want, like, it can't be, if people can't live with that, then it's just not happening. I'm not lowering my standards for nobody. That's why I love myself. If you love yourself first, I swear to God. God, you ain't gonna never cry over another nigga again or another girl. Nobody you ain't gonna cry about no friendships that's ending, no relationships that ending, no situationships, no friends, nothing, nothing. Anything that end, anything that happen, you won't care about it if you love yourself first. So quote of the week, love yourself first, girl, and nobody will. <laughs> that's so solid. I'm so weak. What up for real? Love yourself first, and girl, nobody will. Like, if you don't love yourself first, you and you get in something like even friendship, and this I, I'm heavy on this going for friendships because I have had friendships like these strictly platonic friendships where 
I didn't have my stuff together. They didn't have their stuff together. Or whoever didn't have their stuff together. And then when it came down to it, y'all become friends. And then all y'all emotions pour out. And all that negative energy just clash. And it's just not a cute situation. So get yourself together first. Love yourself first. Know who you are first. Put everything into perspective first. And then go from there. Period. Word of the day. Word of the week. Word of the vlog. Period. If you don't learn nothing else from me, learn that. Love yourself. For sure. Love yourself. Don't mind me just being lazy and I haven't vlogged today. So, hey, what's up? How y'all doing? It is Tuesday. Anyways, update. Just finished this cozy mystery, y'all. The ending. I just bought the third book in the series because I got to read the, the next book like ASAP. Because... The way this just ended, like, are you kidding me? This was so good. This is so good. A perfect second book in the series. Oh, my goodness. Anyways, it is 8.13, and I'm going to go to the gym. I know it's early, and I pray to God they did not think <laughs> um, I think I'm going to do the Stairmaster for five minutes. I mean, I'm going to do some heat exercises. Some It's going to be abs. Mainly abs is not gonna be my focus all this week. Of course, I'm gonna do some arms this week. Gotta have a long a leg day, but I'm focused on cardio and abs. Cause you gotta, gotta get rid of this belly, okay? Also, I've been using this new skincare, and my skin looks terrible. Like I just need to get rid of all this texture on my skin. This dark spot is annoying, and it still hasn't gone away. So that's aggravating but you know that my skin still looks terrible like i had this this mold is around my lip for forever that won't go away like even my chin is so like my face just looks so bad so i don't know if i need to get like an extraction like what do i need to do to get my skin together i'm i cut off dairy for my diet like I'm trying to cut out fried foods, dairy, and bread. And so far, so good. Like, I haven't been eating that many fried foods. Except for, like, Super Bowl Sunday. I ate fried food, I ate dairy, and all this stuff. Day. But, as for, like, all last week, I could, like, I did really good cutting out dairy, cutting out fried foods. Um, bread is hard. Bread is really hard. But, and I've been doing my skincare every single day for the last two weeks. And my skin look like this. Like, I'm annoyed. But anyways, I'm finna head to the gym. Wake up against sweat. I have on some clothes today, baby. Because I'm trying to sweat. I'm trying to sweat. And then I have this black and white sports bras on from Old Navy, y'all. I can't wait to go back on Old Navy. Buy some more sports bras. I literally cannot wait. And probably some more tights, too. Because you can never have too many tights. I really want to shop on, um, not Fabletics, but... The other one that all the Instagrammers be like promoting or whatever, Gym Shark. Have y'all seen the prices? No, thank you. Um, that's not my vibe. Not my vibe. So, but yeah, I'm gonna head to the gym. Let me share the talking. Go to the gym. So, what's up, y'all? How y'all doing? It is Wednesday. Uh, okay, the last day of this vlog. I have determined today's gonna be the last day of this vlog, but it is Wednesday. I got money because surprisingly, I took I took my own car today, not for long, only for um this morning, and then I got back in the Kia. Oh, I still have cash. I thought I got rubies. Apparently not. Anyways. Yeah, so I'm finna go to Walmart and get um I didn't get bread because I'm finna make mini pieces tonight, so I'm just gonna get bread and then I'm gonna get some more apples because we're not apples and I'm gonna get um Damn, what was the other thing? I'm see what kind of ice cream they got. Don't judge me, judge your mama. It was something else. Minced garlic, minced garlic. I'm see what kind of ice cream they got, and I'm getting apples. And um, 
in the bread. And yeah. And there's one thing I want my and I'm gonna get me a tea. I was gonna go to Starbucks and get one of their sandwiches um to eat for right now and then you know later on that's why i make the mini pizzas but uh, it's really windy outside i really, really i already worked over my time so it's like later so i think i'm just gonna skip on star but summer just too far away i don't feel like doing that drive especially since i just got from over there see if i didn't just leave that area like doing a delivery then i will still go to starbucks but since i just left the area i just don't feel like going over there so instead i'm just not gonna go to starbucks my family me some stuff from walmart and um get me a tea i guess for right now as a snack i'm just gonna eat um just gonna eat um is this a park Let's fucking go, bro. Apples and peanut butter. So we got plenty of peanut butter. I'm gonna buy some more apples. So that's the vibe. That's the mood. I'm gonna put some lip gloss on. Okay, I'm tired of my lips. Feeling like these. Mm. Oh, I'll get my wallet. Let's go. I made the TikTok pizzas. I'm gonna show you the one that has bacon on it because it looks the best. Oh, it actually looks so good. It's just the bottom, plain bottom. This is top. I made the one with bacon, but I just made a cheese one because I do not eat pepperoni. So, and it's bacon, bitch, y'all. It's fake bacon. But I'm gonna taste it. So, let's go. Mmm. Okay. It's definitely a really nice snack. Mmm. I think I can use some more sauce. I'm gonna make it again with more toppings for sure. That's good. Y'all, it's on day and I worked through a sweat. What? I'm sweating on arm day. I put in there work. I actually put in some work today. I'm so proud of myself. But anyways. Okay, y'all. Uh, this is going to be the end of this vlog. It's low-key a long one. Like an hour. So, I don't know what I'm going to do editing-wise. But, yes. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you made it all the way to the end, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. And I'll see you at my next one. Bye.